Hey everyone, how's it going? In honor of Martin Luther King Jr. Day, I want to show you guys how to draw a picture of Martin Luther King Jr. Now, to start off with him, we're going to begin with his eyes. So, starting right here, I'm just going to make a circle like this. And then over here, I'm going to draw another circle about the same size. Now, starting right here, I'm just going to make a small black dot in the middle. And then I'm going to do the same thing over here for the pupils. Now, right in between the eyes, I want to make the nose. So starting right here, I'm just going to draw a line that's just going to kind of curve down. It's going to go over and then come back up like this kind of like a little smiley face or a little U-shape. Now, starting over here, I'm going to draw a line that's just going to curve down and then up like this for a smiley face. And then right here, I'm going to draw another line that's just going to go down and then it's going to curve around and then back up for his mouth. Then, starting right here, I'm just going to draw a little curved line like this for his tongue. Now, right here, I'm going to, right next to his eye, I'm going to draw a little line that's just going to kind of curve down and then back up, and I'm going to leave a little bit of space. It's going to be like the letter C. And then over here, I'm going to do the same thing, just kind of curve down and then back up like this. Now, starting right here, I'm going to draw a line that's going to curve up. It's going to go over and then come back down for his head. And then right here, I'm going to draw a line. It's just going to curve down in like this a little bit. And then it's going to kind of curve back up like this, kind of like almost an oval shape. Now, Starting right here, I'm going to make some small bumps like this along the top for his hair. And I'm just going to go all the way to the top and go from one ear to the next. Now, Martin Luther King also has a mustache. So to draw the mustache, I'm just going to color in a little line like this that goes from underneath the nose over to about the edge of his mouth. And then I'm going to do the same thing on this side, just kind of color over here. And I want it to be a little bit bigger towards the middle and then get skinnier as I move out. Now, right up here, I'm going to make two little lines. I'm going to make them a little bit bigger for his eyebrows. And then I'm going to do the same thing here. I'm going to make them a little bit bigger on one end and then a little bit smaller on the other. Then inside of his ears, I'm just going to put a little curved line inside of each one for some detail. Now, I want to make him wearing a suit. So starting right here, I'm just going to draw a line that's just going to go down and then up like this. And then I'm going to repeat the same thing on the other side, just go down and then up. Then right here, I'm going to make a little smiley face for the top of his tie. And then I'm going to make two lines that just go down like this for the rest of the tie. Then starting here, I'm going to draw a line that's going to curve down to here. And then another one that's going to curve down right to here. Now, before I draw any more of his body, I want to draw the little podium that he is going to be standing at. So I ended my tie right here. So starting here, I'm going to draw a line that's just going to go straight across. Then I'm going to draw a little line down on each side. 
And then I'm going to make another line that goes across for the top of the podium. Then, starting here, you want to draw a line that's going to go down. And then another line right here that's going to go down. And you can kind of angle it in just a little bit if you want. And then right across here, I'm just going to draw a line that goes straight across like this. Then at the very bottom, I'm going to draw a little line that goes out on each side. And then I'm going to draw another line that goes down on each side. And then one that goes straight across for the bottom of the podium. Now, to finish off his suit, I'm going to start right here, and all you want to do is draw a line that goes out on each side. Then it's going to go in and out. Same thing on this side, in and out. And then you just want to go straight down at an angle on each side. Now, starting here, I'm just going to draw a line that's just going to curve down, and it's going to go all the way to the podium. And then over here, I'm going to draw a line that's going to go out like this for his other arm. And then I'm going to go down, and then back in like this. And then I'm just going to draw the line down here. Then right here, I'm just going to draw another little line just for the shirt. And then for his hand, I'm going to draw a line that's going to curve up and down for his thumb. And then I'm going to make one little line that goes out and then comes back in for one finger. And then another one here. And then I'm just going to put two more. And then the last one I'm just going to connect right to the sleeve of his suit. And then I'm going to draw a little line right underneath the fingers. And there you go. There is your drawing of Martin Luther King. I'm going to fast forward and start coloring this. Thanks for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed.